when COVID-19 hit us in 2020, we realized that we had a challenge ahead of us. We had a lot of students that were going out for internships and employers were not willing to take them on. We could have substituted this with in-house projects, but that would not have achieved the intended learning outcomes. So then as the Student and Alumni Affairs and the Office of Employability, we are tasked with finding an alternate solution. This is when we started exploring and we found out that uh, there is a company called Virtual Internships that's offering these kind of experiences. We also wanted our students to get that experience of working uh, in a virtual platform and uh, also getting employment if they have those opportunities of which they, ma they managed to do that. We intend to produce well-grounded and rounded students who are internationally uh, recognized, who can fit into any working environment because we are not teaching for Botswana, we are actually teaching for the world. Our learning outcomes are not focused on Botswana, but are focused on producing a person that is very versatile. So having virtual internship with us actually provided us the opportunity now for our students to actually learn what is taking place in other countries and it has been proven that our students are actually capable of being employed internationally. This has given us a lot of credibility where our students can be placed in anywhere part of the world for work for any company from Botswana. So this has also given us students to learn a lot of 21st century skills like collaboration, critical thinking, and then entrepreneurial mindset, communication, leadership. The first one is that uh, our students for uh, accounting and business management, they at attained very good skills in terms of uh, communication skills, leadership skills, time management. In terms of time management, the student, they had to plan and uh, time difference as well. So they had to have sort of a diary, you know, for them to be able to um, discuss with their uh, supervisors. And the other highlight is that um, it is actually very important because our students, they managed to get uh, some, some of them, they, were, they get employed, uh, employed by the virtual um, uh, internship, uh, especially for those where the company that they are working for. So that is very good and uh, commendable. It was a big risk for us. It was something that we had never done before. But we did want to ensure that our students did not miss out on these kind of opportunities. It had been something that we had been wanting to do for a long time. So we decided that let's go for it. And so we contacted virtual internships. We made sure that we aligned our expectations with them in terms of the fact that this is a credit bearing module. So this has a major impact on the student achieving their qualification. And if something like this could be utilized for uh, a credit bearing module. When we realized that they had the expertise to offer, uh, we decided to go for it with a very small cohort of students as a pilot project. And I must say that virtual internships understood our uh, reasonable fears, if I would say so, and went out of their way to allay them because they gave us a lot of support. They were there to answer all our questions. We had intense meetings throughout the process um, at any uh, point of time or at short notice. Virtual internships really made us feel comfortable with the whole offering, and that had Having been said, our students also gave us very positive feedback, though they entered this relationship and this partnership not knowing what to expect. It's the communication. The communication and the attention to detail of virtual internship is outstanding. They actually give, walk you through all the processes. You are able to understand and in the, be in the picture of what is happening. They also do weekly checkpoints, which enables us to nip any problem in the bud before it grows. Even for tutors, they were enabling the tutors to communicate with the supervisors and the students during the mid-coaching call, which enables us also to get to see a picture of what is happening and the challenges that the student is facing and even mapping a way forward. This virtual internship has made our students a better students, a better graduate, and a better employable graduate. So really, uh, it is a tremendous uh, you know, experience, and then it's a great learning 
along with the virtual internship. Uh, that made me to recommend a virtual internship for any industries or any universities to take up this particular in, uh, internship opportunity. I think collectively as higher educational institutions, we have a responsibility to contribute to the national goals. All the countries that we operate in face very high rates of unemployment. We're going to have to look for creative ways to offer the students and graduates that we are producing as universities opportunities to find employment, make meaningful contributions to the economy. Now, whether these are physical or whether these are virtual, it doesn't matter. We as an institution firmly believe that technology can solve a lot of the challenges that we are facing. We've invested into technology from a long time ago. And virtual internship seems to marry the Office of Employability and Technology very beautifully. We also have been trying to place our students uh, globally for many years now. And with labor market issues, with permits, etc., this had always been just a pipe dream for us. With virtual internships, we seem to have cracked the solution to that problem. Quite a few of our students have reported a tremendous gain in their critical thinking skills, their communication skills, their collaboration skills. Um, they have learned a lot of new technologies. All of these are things that we had been trying to uh, inculcate in our students as part of our both our graduate profile. And if there's any partner that will help us achieve these goals, we're all on board with that. And we've now decided to extend our partnership with virtual internships. And this is our third cohort that we are running. We're looking forward to many more.